Inakuwa jewana, mini tuwa Dubrix and of course, boy flani amazing madubi. That's my real name of course, pembeni nipo na it's Ben C. Again of course, ile slogan bado tunaitumia. Ni aje ni aje. Ni kutafuta sana bwana. Nipo nipo nipo. Ongea online kukutana tukutani. Maze. Wewe ni mmoja wa sanii ambao ndo kama wanapush sana kwenye game. Kitu ambacho kina motivate yani kwamba wanapush na sema daily on daily basis lazima niweze kusikika, lazima injili songe mbele waga nini. Uh, I think ni ni vitu mob. Um, kitu ni sukuma sana I think ni wale wa, ile place nimetoka. Eh uh, najua place God amenitoa. And with every song na feel na move a step closer to dream yangu. So nikikumbuka place nimetoka najua God ana plan big. So I keep going. Alafu my fans pia sasa wengine wana kumotivate. When you release a song wanakuambia eh maze mziki mpie kolini vitu kama hizo inakufanya unaendelea ku kutia BD. So I think ni vitu mob sana uni encourage. Damn. Kuna kipindi by the ndo kama ulikuja kapiga ngoma moja fulani ambayo ni safi sana na wife na sijui kama una plans za kuendelea kupiga kazi naye zaidi ama unamfanya fanyaje. Yeah, kuna plans. Actually I think next week or next week but one tunafaa ku shoot video ya our next song. I think itakuwa kama continuation ya Church Girl of some sort. And then we have other songs pia tume plan. Tuna like four five songs tume record ziko tu chini ya maji. So ni planning tuna time na wasio kitu support tutaendelea tu kufanya kazi kazi fit na yeye. Yeah. Yeah. Safi kumekuwa pia na challenge ambazo ni za mziki. Uh, ile challenge ambayo ndo kama Kali alikuchagua kuwa mmoja ya contestant ambao ndo kama walikuwa wamejitokeza wengi ukapata ule mwito wewe kwamba Bensi ni jamaa ambaye anafaa kuwa ameingia pale ndani. Ulichukuliaje personally? Ilikuwa 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 amazing sana cuz uh, considering ilikuwa a secular platform but mimi nikakuja na gospel yangu na nilijua for sure because nafanya gospel sitakuwa welcomed but God alifanya mambo yake na wakanikaribisha and niliona niliona wasanii kama especially calligraph nilimona in a different light is a very good guy na the more tuko naendelea kuongea tukibond na nika nika realize pia mimi kuna kitu nafaa kufanya ile place nimefika naweza support wase So ndio maana hata sasa hii kuna kuna there are new kids wenye na support wanaitwa Bakokos eh, na ilikuwa from hiyo motivation ya calligraph ile kidogo niko nacho sina kingi lakini kidogo cha niko nacho na share na wenzangu na tunaendelea ku grow pamoja tukiangalia uko na production house yako ambayo ni Lux na wasanii ni wengi sana mimi nikiangalia kwenye mtandao kila time na check status zako na post wasanii wana record hawa watu ambao ndo kama wana record Uh, unapangia vipi in terms of kupia kusaidia kupush mziki wao ama wanakuja wana record tu alafu story night eh unaona kitu kama event ya leo eh nimekuja na wasanii wangu so hiyo kwa pia platform ya kuji expose pia ni poa leo i think tumekuwa na three or four interviews na some of the artists tunatoa kwa push ile ile struggle mimi nilipitia hawa sipitie hiyo ndio napata at least two or three artists hizi saidia kila mtu lakini wale kidogo nasaidia pia wataweza kusaidia wengine na hivyo ndio industry na grow. So tuna try kupushiana tu hivyo mdogo mdogo. Yeah. Ani kuregesha nyuma kidogo apart from ile challenge ambayo ndo kama iliwafanya mkapiga collab na Calligraph. Kuna any plans kwamba mtaendelea ku work pamoja ama? Yeah, kuna kuna several songs sitaki ku reveal too much. But I think wasao wakiendelea ku kwa ku follow up on my Instagram on social media zangu watacheki. Kuna plans mob tuko nazo na tuna hope tutaz, tutazi accomplish within the year. So ni wasio endelea kutuombea kutusupport tutafanya kazi. Ah uh, tuje kwa Mashmana. Mashmana by the way leo ndo kama ana launch album yake of course. Uh, niko sure umeweza ku attend na kuangalia some of the performances. Ni kitu gani ambacho ndo kama kimekupendeza kutoka kwa Mashmana? Um Unity ameweza ame, ku achieve. Eh, the, every single gospel artist ako hapa kwa hii platform sahi. Na kuleta watu pamoja hivyo imenikumbusha so many things that zilikuwa tuna enjoy before covid. I didn't think it is kuwa possible msanii kufanya event na ailete wasanii wote pamoja. I didn't think it was possible but I may achieve. Hiyo ndio kitu mimi nibamba the most. The fact that I'm join industry yote pamoja. Yeah yeah yeah. You think sahi wasanii ku transition kwa kutoa album uh, every now and then ni kitu poa ama inaweza ka limit msanii uko mbele? Eh, hey, album ni the best thing yani. Ukianza kufanya album inakuanga a compilation of ideas yenye God amekupea. So ukiza ku compile inakuanga easy na sasa kuna platforms poa sana za kuuza mziki. Hata hapo Lux Entertainment tumefungua a category where we get uh, kufunza wasanii how to sell their music. 
tunawaingiza kwa platforms on how to market and sell their music. So album ni a very nice way ya kukompile na kusell muziki zao. So hiyo ni idea fit sana. Yeah. Ah niko sure lazima najua tumependa but wewe uh, na feel kama tuseme ingekuwa ni wewe umekuja ku launch hiyo album uh, from ile experience ambayo ndo kama umeiona kwa mashmwana ni kitu gani ambacho ungekibadilisha maybe Um hmm. uh, I think me na feel imekuwa fresh mazee Hakuna kitu niweza kosoa cause from planning uh, to investors to corporate to wasanii ku perform to my fans who come through i think i may play i may i may play just fine mimi ningefanya album yangu ningeomba hata ikuwe half as good as kitu ame do leo ah kuna kitu ambacho ndo kama alikuwa nakiulizia ame ame take time yake kufanya audio production ame invest pia pengine pia kufanya videos lakini show imekuwa free unaweka comment gani kuhusiana na hiyo eh hiyo ni amazing cuz inaonesha hawezi fanya event free kutoka kwa mfuko wako so ina maanisha investors wako ready ku chip in into ministry ya gospel which is a very big thing eh, kama corporates wako ready ku chip in into the industry na maanisha industry na grow so hiyo imekuwa kitu fit sana uh, na hope to launch zenye zitakuwa from saa hii zitakuwa too free Yes. Yeah. Yeah, big thanks for your time basi. Itabidi yeah. nikurilize. Alafu issue ya wale mabadogo wako, yeah. bakokoze. Eh yeah. uh, ndo kama nimecheki mwaleta wamepiga nao event. Yeah. Future plan ya wale vijana mm. kwa sababu ni wewe unawasimamia, unaipangaje? There's so much nime plan. Yaani guys have not had any song from Bakokoz. Na kwambia those kids are very talented. Na zile songs tumetoa zilikuwa zile za kupevua tu. There is great music. Kuna song inatoka very soon inaitwa Fetete kuna song inaitwa Afande they zina come zita drop after he so itakuwa hit after hit after hit na tuna hope itakuwa amazing tu yani yeah. tukimalizia wale watoto ndo kama anacheki ni watoto wa shule hata mm-hmm. tukiwa tunaongea wanasema una release maana hiki kesho unafaa kwenda chuo haikupatii yeah. challenge yoyote ukiwa unafanya nao kazi uh, the fact that kwamba ni watoto wadogo ah school ina come fast ni venye ni watano so expense ni five times as much kama ni transport ni five times as much kama ni eh, goes a video ni five times as much but other than that i think imekuwa amazing sana ku work now cause na work na wazazi wao closely na tuna cooperate na inakuwa fresh yeah thanks for time eh yeah. <laughs> anytime nashukuru man kabisa safi